It was brilliant, uh, you know, especially being behind in the game, there is, it's, it's very easy to uh, let the game drift away, uh, but that is not this team is all about. This team is uh, wanting to fight back, wanting to stay in the game as long as possible and not to give it to the opposition that easy. Um, uh, after day one, obviously nothing went our way. Uh, we got bowled out for 46 and then they were 190 for three. And for us to start that second day was very important uh, and try and see if we can not let them get too far ahead of us. Uh, but uh, you know the, that partnership between Rachin and Saudi actually uh, just went uh, a little ahead than what we thought. Uh, but again, then again, second innings with the bat uh, to come out and uh, play like that, uh, it felt like we were ahead in the game at uh, at at one stage. Uh, you know, we didn't feel like we are 350 behind, uh, and that is something that I'm really proud of. You know, uh, when when the guys are showing that kind of uh, attitude on the field uh, with the bat, uh, you know, it shows uh, that the the mindset is very clear and you know the guys want to go out there and play with freedom uh, and try and see how we can put the pressure back on the opposition um, and yeah all in all i thought uh, you know except that uh, first couple of hours three hours i thought we played a very good test cricket minne bilkul dekhiye jab bhi aap test match khelte hai kisi bhi opposition ke samne aapko pata hai ki aapko kya karna hai kaisi opposition hai टीम में आ, ऐसे उनके कोई प्लेयर नहीं है जिनको हमने पहले कभी नहीं देखा है आ, सारे प्लेयर्स के साथ हम खेल चुके हैं हमने उनको काफ़ी देखा है आ, तो प्लानिंग और स्ट्रैटेजी वाइज आई थिंक हमारे लड़के काफ़ी क्लियर थे आ, उनके जो बॉलर्स थे सऊदी हेनरी उन दोनों के साथ हमारे टीम ने काफ़ी खेला है और जो उनका थर्ड सीमर था विल आ, हमने उनके सामने कभी खेला नहीं है बट हमने देखा श्रीलंका में उन्होंने कैसे बॉलिंग किया क्या उनका स्ट्रेंथ है कहाँ पे बॉल डालते हैं बट अगेन देखिए हमने छोटी गल छोटी मोटी गलतियाँ की है इस गेम में आ, और उस गलती का सज़ा हम भुगत रहे अभी बट इसका मतलब ये नहीं है कि सब कुछ ख़त्म हो गया है आ, हमने पहले भी ऐसे मैचेस हारे हैं एंड उसके बाद कम किया है तो हम कोशिश करेंगे कि हमारा माइंड ज़्यादा इस टेस्ट मैच में ना रहे और आगे के दो टेस्ट मैच में हम कैसे खेलना है हमें क्या करना है कैसे यू नो you know, टीम को हराना है हमको ये सोचना बहुत ज़रूरी है तो पुणे में जब जाएंगे हम सोचेंगे देखेंगे पिच क्या है और क्या टीम खिला सकते हैं एक बार वहाँ जाएंगे तो ये सब चीज़ के बारे में बात करेंगे नो सी वेन यू कम यूर यू you want to play the game you are not thinking about uh, what the conditions are what is going to happen and stuff like that because that is not in your control at all um whatever the situation of the game is you uh, unless you believe it you are not going to achieve it so that is the mindset that is the talk that is the approach this team has uh, and i can say it again and again uh, that this team is not going to give it back uh, give it so easily uh, we want to keep fighting till till it's over uh, and that's what that's what we did you know with the bat we were superb in the second innings uh, i thought the way we played uh, was superb uh, and to get them to chase that 100 runs also was a great effort you know uh, after being 100 and, uh, 350 behind uh, but when you're chasing a small total like that you you, you know uh, on a pitch uh, uh, where there is so much, so much cricket has been played, uh, there is a lot of wear and tear in the pitch. Anything is possible, and we've got the quality in our bowling lineup who can who can achieve that. Uh, so, of course, we came with the belief of you know trying to pull the results towards us. Uh, but yeah, it didn't happen. We tried everything we could uh, today morning, uh, but it was just not for us uh, this game. Uh, uh, you got to give credit to the New Zealand; they played well. Yeah, look, I'm not the person who talks after every single game uh, to individuals. Uh, they know exactly where they stand in their game, where they stand in their career. Uh, we we don't change our mindset based on one game uh, or one series. Uh, you know, the messages are thrown at them quite early uh, at the start, and then they know exactly where they stand and what the situation is of the team. Uh, so. Yeah, uh, I don't think I'm going to talk anything different that uh, different from what I've been talking to them. Uh, it's pretty simple 
anyone who gets an opportunity will have to will have to try and make an impact in the game uh, that is that is a simple message that we keep talking about uh, and uh, yeah it's it's always nice to have you know these kind of players waiting uh, to play the game uh, you know it was unfortunate that shubman missed this game uh, and sarfraz took that opportunity got a big 100 uh, it's it's a good sign for the team yeah look uh, about his injury i i think see he's had a massive operation on his leg uh, so we all know what he went through uh, so it's just to be a little careful about uh, you know uh, where he is at and what he is to us uh, even when he was batting he was not comfortably running uh, you know he was trying to only put the ball in the stands uh, but again uh with someone like him we just need to be extra careful uh because he's had a lot of uh minor surgeries one big surgeries on his knee uh, and he and he went through a lot of uh trauma to be honest uh in the last one and a half years so it's just about being extra careful not careful uh with him uh so you know when you're keeping you have to bend every ball uh, with your knee going down uh, and the wicket being what it was uh, we thought it's the, it, it is the right thing to do for him to stay inside and then get 100% ready for the next one and like i said about his innings uh, uh, no one knows what goes in his mind uh, to be honest uh, he decides what he wants to do and that is the kind of freedom also we want to give it to him uh, you know because he has produced uh, performances with that mindset so <coughs> i don't think there is anything that you need to speak to him um, we spoke to him about please understand the situation and stuff like that but you know that's rishab uh, he wants to play uh, in a certain way and then you know as a captain as a coach we want to back that uh, you know because like i said his produce results for us uh, you know having that mindset so let him go and play freely see uh, every time we play the game every time we play the test series first test you don't want to lose a game you we, we don't go with that mindset of just uh, playing casual cricket uh, you know you 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 want to try and do everything possible uh, you know uh, to go out there and do it uh, just happened to be that we lost against england we came pretty close lost by 20 runs there uh, even here uh, there are a lot of good things that happened as well along with you know 3 3 to 4 hours of bad cricket uh, so uh, keeping a lot of cricket in mind keeping a uh, couple of test matches coming up i i'm not going to look too much into uh, this test match honestly because that that three hours is not going to dictate what this team is uh, you know because it will be very unfair for us to think about those three hours and start judging players and talk slightly differently uh, i think it's important to keep a consistent message in the group uh, which is you know to try and make a way whenever we are put under pressure try and make a way into the into the game uh, in whatever possible way uh, and that is what we've been talking about and we really found a way to come back into this game uh, with the bat in the second innings uh, and i of course we lost a test match that's why probably it, it won't look or it won't make sense of what i'm talking but uh, i feel th there honestly has been a lot of good things that happened in this game uh, and i'm really proud of each and every one to go out there and play like that and show that attitude uh, you know looking forward to the second test match in pune we know exactly what to expect and uh, where we lie as a team uh, so it's just about keeping a very calm atmosphere uh, not to send panic messages and stuff like that it is it's important that we stay strong and try and see how we can nail that second game no it's absolutely brilliant i have you know hats off to the crowd honestly uh, even though it was raining i could see everyone sitting in the stands waiting for the game to start a uh, very very passionate crowd as we have seen it uh, in bangalore uh, over the years they love the game they love the sport and they love their team uh, so uh, for them to just come here and you know keep waiting uh, for the match to start uh, you know shows the kind of passion they have and 
obviously with with the result not being in our favor i could st still sense that you know the crowd wanted us to win the game and they were right behind us uh, which is which is what you expect in india uh, but like we we don't take our crowds for granted we don't take our spectators for granted we respect them uh, and we understand you know how much of a role they play in our success as well so it's very very important to us when they come sit out there and uh, you know wanting to watch watch us play and you know wanting for us to win the game so yeah like i said we are very very grateful to have uh, you know people like that watch us play yeah i look uh, when when we are behind the game that is where you want to press your pedal even more uh, you know and try and make an impact try and not let the opposition know that we are under pressure or we are behind the game uh, we when you are actually behind you want to try and do extraordinary things and uh, play without any fear uh, it's one thing to talk about it but actually we went out there and played some fearless cricket uh, some of the shots some of these guys played in the middle knowing that we are 350 behind shows you know what we've been talking about and what they want what they are wanting to go out there and do and that is that is how it's going to stay here uh, even if we find ourselves ahead in the game we are not going to change our attitude uh, and on the other side as well even when we are behind the game uh, we're going to try and see how we can put the pressure on the opposition some of the test matches we played recently uh, shows what I actually i'm talking about uh, and that's how it's going to be we are not going to fear of losing a test match uh, by changing our mindset we want to have that consistent mindset of trying to find a way to win test matches uh, even though you are behind in the game you have to find a way whether it is putting the putting the bowler under pressure or putting the batters under pressure by you know doing various different things as yeah, shubman seems okay at, at this point in time yeah i was having a chat with ash uh, he was telling me there's rain coming on coming from the south side uh, so I, we were just discussing uh, okay is it the south side or the north side so that was the discussion yeah look um the first innings uh, i thought you know uh, whatever we could extract from the pitch uh, our spinners tried and did everything possible in their way, uh, in uh with them uh some of the some of the shots that rachin played was a really really good shot and he played very good cricket he played well against the spinners uh, they challenged him but you know you got to give credit to him because you know he he played well he understood what our spinners were trying to do uh and he didn't back off from playing his natural game uh, which is what gave him the result against our quality spinners uh, sometimes you know it happens where you know not sometimes actually there will be times where some of the some of the batters who come to india they will play well against our spinners uh, we we saw in england series in the first test match couple of the batters got hundreds uh, and uh, yeah even here rachin uh, conway they played well uh, you know put our bowlers under pressure spinners under pressure by playing different shots which can happen which we we are expecting as well from from their batters uh, anyone who's coming to india now you know they're trying to put uh, the the pressure on the bowlers by doing different things different methods uh, but we know exactly what we are supposed to do uh, when the situation like that arises uh, we did that but you know, you know they, they they played well they got the result they they got runs uh, and then uh, uh, speaking about bumrah look uh, you know uh, there was something in the help uh, something in the pitch uh, with the new ball uh, in all four innings so we wanted to try and see how much we can extract from the new ball uh, you know bumrah got couple of wickets so i want him to bowl an extended spell he agreed to it uh, he was ready for it uh we didn't have enough runs on the board it was only 100 runs so we wanted to make the best of best use of the new ball with the quality seamers that we have and then uh see where the game goes uh, you know we tried really hard with the new ball siraj bowled a brilliant spell as well didn't get the result but uh, again i thought mumra with, with with the new ball was superb uh, got couple of wickets uh, any bowled bowled his heart out